Yo, welcome back. Zykor here. And today in Re-Legend, I'm continuing on watering my plants as usual. I gotta um, get over here and water these without watering just the ground. I gotta fertilize these too. Uh, let's see. Um, today in Re-Legend though, I am guess... Well, I was thinking I should probably try to finish the Zan Tribe dancing. I guess because yeah, I, I've been putting it off. I guess doing some other stuff. So yeah, it's probably about time that I start on that. Let's see. Let's make sure here. I don't can't remember now how many days I've had this. Okay, no, nope, can't use it yet. No, I don't want to throw my precious supersizer. Okay. Um. Yeah. I uh, might as well refill my watering can. And I think I needed to, but there we go. Gunther, did you? Did you get your fill here of stuff? I hope you did. Let's move that over there where I wanted it. Okay, let's get over here. Check my fishies. Check my water crops. Fishies are still fed. And I might as well just grief one of my fish here and pull it out because I like to grief my fish. Let's see, let's try the Gannis this time. So withdraw. Now, there we go. And then just throw him in here because yeah. There we go. Get over here, Buster. Help me scare these fishies away. Then you can go about your business. There we go. You can go about your fishy business. Sometimes I wonder what my fish are doing in the pond here. I mean, I see them I, I, actually, most of the time, I don't see them because I, yeah, they're either off somewhere on their own or something. I really don't know. Oh, good. My Wataros are done. Okay. That's it for that. Let's, hey, come on. Give me. Okay. Fine. There we go. No, that's not one's done yet. Okay. Get over here. Yeah, there's lots of times I can't find my fish, so I wonder... What are they up to? Because you never know what fish are up to because they're always, you know, fish are fishy. So it's like, you never know what they're doing. Maybe they're plotting against me to take over my water field and, uh, I don't know, eat all the fish food or something like that. Grief my plants, I have no idea. <laughs> okay, let's see, anybody hungry here? I hope not. Eh, good. Doesn't look like they're hungry. So let's just brush and pet everyone. Hello, you two. Grab up my brush here. So talk and pet. Uh, talk and pet? Talk and brush. Okay. Let's get in here. Hello, Graz. Hello, Stubbs. Putter. I didn't get to putter in time. There we go. Come on. At least I got Bloop to four hearts. I should be able to actually evolve Bloop probably soon, but Bloop isn't near 45 at all. So yeah, it's going to be a while. Let's get over here. I'm not sure the best Magnus to take to the, you know, the dance. I mean, there is no best Magnus to take to that because you don't use a Magnus. But it's like, you know, I just got to get through the forest. So technically, let's just see. What levels are my Magnus here? 20. I mean, they should all be about the same level because it levels all of your Magnus about the same rate. Okay. So Prune Spike is still the lowest level. But Moo is 19. He's the next lowest. So I'll maybe just keep this. Let's keep it at this. Let's go, guys. Now I should head out to Amelia's house, which I might as well just go this way, shouldn't I? So go through here. Because I should buy one of the teleport totems because I ha I don't have one. I had to use it a couple episodes ago. 
So, yeah. Now! I was holding the button. Get over here. There we go. Run around and over here. This should bring me up to Amelia's house. Right here. Let's see if Amelia's here. She should be. Actually, what day is it? I should look. Eh. Okay, it is a Wednesday. Nothing special going on. Okay. Hello, Amelia. How is work at the farm? Uh, so-so. Talk to her. Welcome, I've got a great selection of goods at my store. Feel free to browse. I'm always browsing your store, Amelia. Most of the time I'm browsing you. Okay. Let's see, buy one teleport totem. Uh, mini totem. Yeah, I'm buying teleport totems, I guess. Oh, yeah, Amelia agrees, why not, yeah. Okay, buy. There we go. That's really all I needed. I have no money to buy any of this stuff. I did want to get these wings. Maybe I should just go into my testing save and get them just to see what they look like. Huh. I feel like it. Okay. I don't think I need anything else, did I? No, I don't have any money to buy anything else anyway. Okay. So I'm going to head over to the forest island. Brush in hand. I don't know why I'm still holding my brush. Now I'm holding my sword. Hello, Pia. I'm just coming to come after you with this sword. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so head over here. And you know what? Yeah, as much as I hate to do it, I'm gonna go pay Amelia. Wait a second. How can I pay Amelia if I've got only a thousand Z? G. Hmm. Not good. I should just use the fish. This would give me 20% stamina. I don't know. Oh well, fine. I'll just pay Amelia, it'll be easier. I said I wasn't gonna use Amelia. <laughs> no, Amelia, not Amelia, Edna. I think I've been saying Amelia, Edna, Edna. Where'd you go, Edna? No. Okay, so she's gonna deny me a heal. So I guess I'm going to head out. Oh wait, let's check the quest quick on the quest board. Since we're over here, I think that we're gonna reset one of these days. So just head over here. Looks like I'm gonna have to use my items anyway. Hello, Gunther. Okay, sleepless nights. Uh, yeah, that uh, deadly ores. Have, some, have to collect some rare ores that are in the Nurlik cave. The problem is that it's infected with Nurliks. Can anyone help chase them out? So I have to de be defeat Nurliks. Hmm. I still, that Terraton one keeps tempting me, but I, I know I can't do it. So, yeah, the Nurlik cave one could be useful, but I don't know if I can beat the Nurliks yet. I don't know. I'd have to test it. I mean, I guess, you know what? It doesn't hurt to just accept it, since I'm going to the forest island anyway. I don't know how many I have to defeat. Let's see. How many do I have to defeat? Let's see here. Uh, deadly ores. Nine Nurlicked. Whew. Well, we'll have to see. And Lloyd's only, only give me gold ore for that. Not quite worth it, Lloyd. So head back out here. And maybe I should ride Dracophine or Magus because, yeah, I'm getting low on Stam. Hello, then. Get down here. Around here. Let's just go through the field. There we go. Okay, who is going to volunteer? I guess you are. There we go. Oh, wow, my fish are actually there. Wow. Huh. I can find my fish for a change. Okay, let's head over to the forest island here. Go this way. I mean, I guess I can try to beat some Nurlik. I've got pretty good magic on these two, so I guess it's possible. Let's get out here. go through the water and all the rain and 
past the baby bits and the ore tons and grab cocoa melons. Get over here. I think I I still need to level up my my sword swinging as well yet. Actually, let's see. What's it at? Uh, right here. My sword swinging is level four, and it's like um, like hardly anything away from level five. So yeah, I really want to level that up. I want to get the charge. Okay, let's see what I do to Nearlight. Eleven damage. And they do 90-something. Well, I can... Well, actually, they're hard to defeat. Yeah. Oops. You know, that's Mouse Drift. Yeah. Whoa. Heal me, Draco Magus. Heal. Come on, Magus. Get off. Would you stop running away? And it healed itself. That's not fair. I was doing a lot of damage. Uh, actually, it took a lot of time, a long time to do all that damage. Oh, nuts! 170 damage to me. Come on! About time you healed, Magus. At least I think so. This is actually a hard one. Because Nurlik are hard to beat. I think they must have a lot of defense or something. Stop hitting me with that. You don't need to do 180 damage to me. Oh, you know, let's... Did I... Oh, I do have the charge now. Haha, let's see what that does. Oh, I... And it looks like I can only use it every now and then. Would you stop healing? And I missed with it. It's gonna take me a little while to beat these nine. It's doing 137 damage. Would you stop doing crits? Finally, I tell ya. Let's see what this does. Nine damage. I f that was like unimpressive. I feel like my charges need to do more damage. At least I'm doing some damage with it. There we go. Okay, that is three of them. Painstaking. Okay, let's see. And I'm nearly out of stamina. And it's nearly night. So I don't want it to... I don't want to miss the dance. So I'm going to have to go out and do that. Because, yeah, I don't want to... I don't want to faint during it. So let's get over here. Maybe I'll do like three each day or something like that. <laughs> They're not easy to beat. I need better equipment. Or stronger Magnus. Because they must be like level 20 or something. 20 or maybe 25. Because yeah, my Magnus are weak. Okay, get over here. There we go. Okay, I want to make sure my stam is topped off. Hold. Eat a couple of these. There we go. 
Hello. I'm here to take your dance. That amazing. Has everything? Then follow Chief Gobi. Okay. We're gonna do this. Chief Gobi hopes that Little Nazy now understands significance of offerings. Um, I think I do, but I might have forgot it. Just to be sure, Chief Gobi will check. Is quiz time. Eh, nuts. Yeah, I don't know if I remember all these. First offering is great item, symbol of strength, self-control, and keeping promises. Is symbol of true hero. What did First Zan do with first offering? Uh, she used it to help herself get out of an impossibly deep hole. She used it to mercifully end the life of a deer. She used it to see who two figures fighting in the mist were. Um, symbol of a true hero. But the first offering. I can't remember. <laughs> Maybe I should have reviewed. Let's see. Um, I, I don't know if you can get it wrong. But we'll see. He might correct me. <laughs> um, symbol of strength. Well, um, let's just see this. Good, good. Second offering helps overcome obstacles by bringing more opportunities. Uh, overcome obstacles by bringing more opportunities. Okay, that was that probably is the. Yeah, the top one. Maybe not same path originally wanted, but still the path moving forward. So, little nazing. What did First Zen do with second offering? She used it to help herself get out of an impossibly deep hole. I'm pretty sure that that's what it probably is. Good, good. Last offering is best when need make good decisions or judgment. Is symbol of knowledge. Victory of knowledge over ignorance. So, little nazing. What did first Dan Zan do with third offering? And that would be she used it to see who two figures fighting in the mist were. There we go. Chief Gobi is pleased. Little amazing. Now knows story of first Zan. Understand Zan tribe better. Chief Gobi is pleased. Little amazing now. Wait. He just said that. Uh, Gobi, you're repeating yourself. I, maybe you need to see a doctor for that? I don't know, dude. Or maybe you should just stay off the the mushrooms. That might be the better thing. Understand Zan values better. Now Zan people can truly become little nazing. Wait, truly become? <laughs> uh, truly become little nazing. Yeah, really. No, truly welcome little nazing. I don't know how I read that wrong. Now is okay for little nazing take part in festival. Now can enjoy. Okay. Since little nazing is from outside village, Chief Gobi will help. Follow what Chief Gobi does. So if I'm supposed to just enjoy the festival, then why are you basically testing me with the dance? <laughs> but Chief Gobi hopes that Little Nazing has good sense of rhythm, because now Little Nazing must feel the music. Oh no. Okay. Very good. You have done well, Little Nazing. Round one. Three, two, one. Go. Okay, let's see. W. A. S. D. Ah, oh, so just going wazd. <laughs> w. A. S. And D. Not bad at all. We shall proceed to the next phase. Yeah, I think there's three phases. Round two. Three, two, one. Getting harder. W. S. D. D. W. W. S. D. D. And W. There we go. Splendid. Let's see if you can keep up the phase. Eh, well. Hopefully I will, be Gobi. Show me your moves, dude. A. Okay. D. D. W. 
add ws s a d d w s s add was very good you have done well little amazing Okay, good. Oh, little Nazing has great rhythm. Chief Gobi is impressed. Most Nazings cannot feel music well. Stumble and trip. Out of tune. Out of rhythm. Horrible to ears. Well, uh, you know, I'm better than most Nazings. I don't even know who Nazings are anyway. <laughs> no, I think he's referring to Nazings as humans. Something like that. Back when Chief Gobi, not Chief yet. Remember, two tiny Nazings could follow very well. Very tiny. But was so long ago. Okay, that means I've been here before. Yeah, because that was probably me. And my brother. So, Chief Gobi must ask, What is Little Nazing's name? Cannot keep calling Little Nazing Nazing for anymore. Uh, yeah, it would have been better if you would have asked me my name to begin with. Yeah, it's Zykor, dude. Then, Chief Gobi proudly give this to Zykor. Thank you for taking part, for take part in Zan Festival. Make festival more lively and merry. Okay, yeah, you're laughing at my at my dance moves or something? Zygor deserves it. Zygor is one of Zan tribe now. Is welcome back anytime. Okay, that's fine, dude. Uh, I probably won't be back again. Other than maybe to do fusion or something. Other than that, uh, so long, Gobi. I I'm done here. Uh, let's see. I might as well say goodbye to him. Zygor, the Zan tribe welcomes you. Uh, yeah, um, goodbye. <laughs> okay that is it now for this let's see um, now I think all I need to do is go back to Yuri that wrong area yes brewing solution uh, brewing a solution and I need to beat those Neuralix so <laughs> that's going to be a task okay let's just ride wait I went the wrong direction I should talk to Maha sometime, but I want to get to Yuri, maybe try to get this finished. Uh, but the temptation of coal and silver is too great. Just grab these. I'm left to... S there we go. How dare I leave a silver behind. There we go. Come on. If I was going to do mining, I probably should have... Oh, you know, I need stapella logs, too. Nuts. Get these. There we go. Rubrum logs as well. Yeah, I might as well just do this stuff late into the night. I wonder if Yuri will pause time for me. 2130... I mean, I guess I could say I still have, like, three in-game hours. Two and a half. Come on. Prince, what are you stuck on a tree stump for? Okay, let's visit Yuri. Get over here. And up here. All the way over here. And up and through here. And Hawk. Hello, Hawk. Yeah, Hawk, you're still sick, dude. I mean, how can you be sick for that long? Uh, I tell ya. He's even in the rain. That's gonna make him sicker. Hawk, man. I mean, get over it, dude. I mean, not really get over it. I mean, pull out of it. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> you're in a dire situation. <laughs> Okay, get over here. I'm running low on time now. Now I'm running into a wall. Get over here. Now I'll come bursting into Yudi's house. Hello, Yudi. I'm done with your quest that you decided to just shove on me. Well done. Give me a moment to complete the concoction. Yeah, and then all she does is just 
make a concoction out of what I just brought. And I did a whole bunch of work, work for this when you could have just done it yourself. There, now finish the job and clear the thorns in front of my house, would you? Yeah, see how lazy she is? <laughs> eh, I tell ya. Okay. Go ahead, give it a spin. I'm sure you'll be amazed by my genius. Yeah, this is just to clear brambles that didn't need to be there anyway. Well, now I can at least get to Wilker in various areas. This gives me more free reign to go around the forest island. I guess my work here is done then. The life of a hermit grows stale. A chain of, pa of place certainly sounds exciting. Yeah, I guess go to the Volca town and maybe I can buy some ruins from you, even though I have no money. I'd like to witness your heroic re return to Volca town. And you can't do that if you're dead. Well, um, yeah, who says I'll die? I'll see you back there, won't I? Oh, and do be careful when you meet your friend, the Guardian. Um, yeah, I, that's not going to be easy. But you know what? It doesn't matter. If I meet the Guardian, Edna will just bring me back. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. It gave me some quests, and now my inventory is full. Uh, let's see here. Check these quests. Heart of the Forest. Seek out the Forest Guardian. And that's going to give me some bracelet that'll be interesting i never got that in past playthroughs of course if you want to check out my previous playthrough season two and i even have a season one but yeah check those out they're linked in the description hermit no more i have to yeah visit beauty by the vulcan gate she'll set up her shop and stuff like that okay and i tell you like len what does he want this stuff for? I really don't know, but I guess I can get a Silka log. And he's going to actually steal three of my Sea World logs that I had a hard time farming. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. Over here. Well, now I can battle Windhorn. And I can get... Actually, let's get a Silka log. There we go. Three circle logs. No! Ho, ho, ho. Okay, what can I get rid of? I can't get rid of anything because I forgot to put my fruit and vegetables in the storage box. Yeah. Okay. Well, circle logs are more important than a Nurek thorax, thorax. And this is a common item. So let's hold this. There we go. I can't beat anything else, so I'm a, I guess I should just go back, especially since it is uh, almost midnight. So let's get through here. Might as well go up. Actually, go. I guess usually I went down and around, not up and around, but oh well. So get over here. I could go get a rubrum log over there, but oh well. I think they made that forest a little darker in there, didn't they? In the past, it wasn't that dark. Okay, let's just get back because it's midnight and I'm going to faint if I don't. I wish I had... No, I don't, I don't want to have to use my mini totem this quickly. Ah, nuts. And I have to beat the, de the guardian to get a teleport totem or I should say to get the teleport totems to work okay hold okay let's and I accidentally used my <laughs> uh, I'm yeah I'm gonna faint I don't want to faint again okay yeah Hold. I don't have enough stamina to get back. I'm using these left and right. Okay. Sleep. There we go. 
Wow, at least I'll have full health now. That's good. Now, I'm going to put these in here appropriately now. Let's see. More chew pods. Uh, just put those in there like that. And this, this, this. And put the silk logs there. That. I don't think I have any Nerlict items. So I'll have to add a spot for them. Hmm. Where would I add them? Probably... it would be on the next page. No. <laughs> uh, I could do something funky. Go down here. Like this. I guess. Okay. Well, uh, that was pretty productive, I guess. I finished the... Um, the Zan Tribe quest. Actually, I finished Yudi's quest. So now I can. Um, yeah. I can buy tomes from her in the village. Not tomes. What? Are they tomes? No, they're. Ruins. Ruins. Yeah, I'm picking up weeds instead. I was gonna try and sell some of these chew pods because. Or uh, kukors, I mean, because, yeah, I. They're still watered, too, so that's nice. Come on. Let me a access the box. Okay. Uh, I don't have very many of those, though. So let's just sell some of these Kukors. I'm only getting at 1,300. You know, Gunther is a cheapskate. He doesn't give me much. He can give me more money. Okay, head out here. I just want to go unlock Yudi here while I'm at it. Because... Yeah, I mean, why not? Okay. Yuri. Hello, Yuri. Yes, I see your house. And that's it. But, you know, let's check the runes that she has. Okay. Hello, are you missing me already? Um, well, maybe. Talk. Ah, village life. So very quaint. Shallow conversations about weather and how we're all doing. Okay. I prefer my conversations deep and intimate. Uh, okay. Shop. What does she have? So, 3,000 for the lesser heal rune. Heal self by 25% of max health. Cool down 30 seconds. Not bad. That was actually interesting. Haste rune. I have one of those. Got one for free. You get this. You get the haste rune for free on your farm by swimming down to the bottom right and, uh, you know, through your large fish pond. There will be a char chest over there. For anyone that hasn't seen my previous episodes early on when I got that. Quagmire, create a circle on the ground that slows enemies' speed by 35%. Hey, not bad. That's interesting. Stone throw rune, deal 50 plus physical plus magical attack times 0.25 in a straight line. Okay. And mega volt rune, deal physical plus magical attack times 1.25 around the caster. Okay. Well, you know, it's pretty good. At least they give the calculation right there, so you they can bit there. You can tell how much damage you're gonna probably do. So that's nice. So this one's just an AOE around you. This one here is a straight line out in front of you. Interesting. Interesting. And this one is just a circle on the ground, probably in your general vicinity. But I think I want to get the heal rune, because that would be useful for the guardian. I mean, the megavolt rune it wouldn't be too bad either. But I don't know if these do these run on magic attack, or do they just have their own? Oh no, I'm being a dork. It shows the calculation: physical plus magical, so it's both. Hmm. That leaves open special builds. I can think of for like rune builds. Interesting. That's a that's a thought. You could have a rune build with a you know a stat build for specifically for runes. You know, using runes, physical and magical attacks. So you 
put points into strength and uh, int? That's a possibility. But you only got two runes, at least at the beginning here. I'm, I'm sure more runes come in later. But anyway, yeah. I guess that's probably it for this episode. What is this anyway? Is this Yuri's room? Or is this like a bathroom? I have no idea. <laughs> Wait, why is this blocked off? Is it blocked off on the other side? Yes, it's blocked off on the other side. So she doesn't let me go see her board or her telescope? That's not fair. Okay, well, yeah, getting out back out here. Back to the farm. I'm going to end up having to buy myself another teleport or mini totem. Because, yeah, I, I had to use it yet again. I'm always out too late. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, that's it for this episode. If you like this episode, hit that like button. I really appreciate it. It really helps us out a lot. If you haven't already, subscribe. Hit that bell icon. Leave a comment. And, of course, share it. And come join our Discord because there's lots of chat in there. And, and you know, I'm in there. Everybody's in there. Yeah, it's just a great place to be. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. I'm going to sell a weed here. Gunther, you forgot to take the weed. Gunther, get back here. He, he left. Uh.